What's going on, Steam Team? I know it's been a while since we've been cleaning carpets because, like I say, we still quarantining. You know, um, things ain't just safe down here yet. You know, I told my wife we may start back May 1st, but um, we still trying to debate. So right now, um, we've been doing the homeschooling with the kids. Y'all been seeing some of those videos. We're going to keep uploading them. But I figured I want to do a project with the kids and I want to show y'all too, Steam Team, how we go about removing stains out of carpets. So y'all just um, stay tuned and just enjoy this little clip right quick. All righty, we're going to let the kids mess up the carpet and then I'm going to um, show y'all how we take stains out of carpets. Okay, Steam Team, I'm going to let the kids decorate this carpet and then we're going to, um, I'm going to wait till probably Saturday, let the stains sit in good, and then Saturday, I'm gonna go out to my van, I'm gonna crank up my um machine, and I'm gonna do um, I'm gonna get all my little spotting different spotting um treatments I have and see what I can do about getting them stains out. So, y'all just stay tuned, okay, guys. I got some good old hot sauce, some sesame seed oil, I got some strawberry syrup. Some Heinz ketchup, some Heinz mustard, and some chocolate syrup. And then I'm going to get the kids to go downstairs and get some crayons and some markers and maybe some ink. And we're going to decorate this carpet. So, what's up, Steam Team? All right. I'm going to let the kids pick their favorite condiment. Oh, that go to Wifey. Hi, Steam Team. What's going on? Yeah, we just sitting here quarantining, y'all. But um, I'm going to let them pick which one they want, and they're going to make their own little section of the carpet and put their condiment into the carpet, and we're going to mesh it down real good. And like I said, I'm going to let it sit for three days, and Saturday we're going to work on those things. And that's right. Yeah! All right, y'all. Pick your weapon of choice. Okay. Steam team, y'all, we have decorated the carpets. We got some mustard, we got ketchup, we got some marker, we got some sesame seed oil, we got some uh, chocolate syrup, we got some more marker, we got some ketchup, and we got some strawberry syrup. And like I said, I'm going to let this sit until Saturday, so y'all just hold tight. All right, guys, it is now Tuesday, and I posted to head clean this carpet. Saturday, but I'm doing it today. Do y'all remember when we had treated this carpet? Let me show y'all. Y'all remember the kids decorated this carpet? I think this was chocolate. This was ketchup. This was on um, what that was? Strawberry syrup. That was mustard, and that was some hot sauce. And then they took some markers and just wrote on it. Some sesame seed all right here. You can't even see it. And they took markers and wrote on it. So we finna um, see how well we can get these stains out. Show y'all how we treat stains. And um, the reason why we charge more for stains versus just regular carpet cleaning. Because regular carpet cleaning alone will not get these stains out. Y'all already know that. I was gonna put some Kool-Aid on here, but y'all done saw us remove um, Kool-Aid stains. So I got my spotting kit right here. And I'm finna pre-spray this carpet like we normally do. If you don't mind, Miss Huey, can you get that pre-spray right here? Pump it up. It's just, it's, it's just regular pre-spray I use for the couch. Pump it up. Y'all ain't never seen her doing the pumping action. 
and just spray it regular. All right, y'all, so see applying the pre-spray like we work regular pre-spray carpet. It's not as strong now coming out because we're not hooked up to the hydro force. We're using the old pump method. Y'all see that old pump spray? I can't get the wifey on here because we've been chilling in the house. Y'all already know, ain't no hair salons open. <laughs> but just, um, yeah, just hit it, that's good. All right, y'all, so we're gonna pre-spray this carpet like we normally do. And I'm gonna let that dwell. And then we're gonna take our little tool and we're gonna start extracting it to see what it does. I'm gonna even agitate it. Just to show y'all the big difference. All right, guys, I'm gonna just go ahead and agitate it. I'm just gonna use this. As y'all see, oh wow, it's coming. It's moving, so it's like it's gonna come out pretty good. I don't wanna really spread them. I'm just agitating these spots. Just put a little agitation on it, y'all. Look at that carpet, already looking good. I ain't got but one glove left. I've been using the gloves. So we're gonna see what it do once we start extracting. That's why I said don't spray so much. See how it come through. Your, your pre-spray don't hold to come through. It's supposed to be on top. Yeah. And see that? That you see how that stain came through? Now that was that surge. It was liquid. That's why I be telling people when they have liquid stains. See, ain't no other stains came through. It was just that. So that's why I tell people when they have liquid stains, it go through. See it go into the paddy. And see, this is what I was trying to show you. When you over pre-spray. It just, it just run through. You don't, your back is not supposed to get wet. That's why when you pre-spray, you just lightly glide. So you just wasting your pre-spray. Yeah, that's why I be telling you less is better. What they say, less is more. You see what I'm saying? Now you see that. So that just goes into the pan. Less is best. Yeah, less is best. Even though we suck it, it still pulls it back up. But you shouldn't, you shouldn't wet it that bad. Cause not with your pre-spray. Because your, your, um, you notice when we clean with this spray, how it, it fans out with our um wand, it don't it ain't gonna just penetrate down in there like this pre-spray. So now you see that. So now when you clean from now, when you pre-spray from now, just give it a mess. All you wanna do is just give it a light coating. You hear me? Give it a light coating. Y'all see girls and boys, that chocolate. And that was what? That was the ketchup. Give it that red. There was mustard, that was the hot sauce. And that red stuff. So once we go over it. That red stuff was the um. That strawberry stuff. All right, we finna go over it now. It's been dwelling. And then we're gonna see if we're gonna need our spotting kit. But it seems like the pre-spray and the agitation did a good job. We're gonna see what it do, hold on. The ST steam Now, 
That's now that's why I need my flood. My flood is strapped. You see what I'm saying? I'm gonna I'm gonna do I'm gonna show y'all the flood is strapped.
see is all the organic things came out with the regular pre spray. And I use soap daddy prime time with enzymes in it. Y'all see all that organic things? It came out. Y'all seen that? All the things that was food related, that's organic. It came out, right? But y'all see the synthetic things, which is this marker, ink, paint, tar. Those still in there, right? Those where you got to get your spotting stuff. Now watch this.
Yeah, I wasn't trying to get all that slime out of your room. Okay, I gotta go through all this. Yeah, you didn't say it that way. When all that fell, about something else we tried. See, steam team, this is what we charge to remove spots. So this is a process. Guess what? We don't we don't uh, always guarantee stains to get out all, all the stains to come up, but we tell the customer we'll do our best. Yeah. Right. If this right here don't get it, it ain't coming.
Yes, it's gonna get there, guys. You got it. I'm gonna try one more thing. I'm gonna call it quits out there. If all fails, get you some gasoline and just burn the rug. G gas is what it's called. We're not finna burn the rug for real. But we are about to use the gas. All right, boys and girls, don't try this at home. That's right. Guys, I just mixed up my um the D gas and I put some scissors in there. Now I'm finna y'all see it's all really about going. Look at that. Ain't too much left. So we finna extract and see what happens. Alright? Alright. Thank you. 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 Thank you.